Well, a 13-year-old boy now facing a criminal homicide charge after allegedly shooting another 13-year-old inside this house on Wilson Avenue. A community hurting as they grieve the loss of a 13-year-old boy who was allegedly got down by another 13-year-old. My first reaction was no, no. 13-year-olds ain't supposed to be carrying guns. 13-year-olds are not supposed to be shooting each other. Words from council member Charlene Wade Prescott, who didn't wish to appear on camera today for personal reasons, but still weighed in on the tragedy that happened in her Clareton neighborhood. To know that these kids are carrying guns around here and anything can happen, yeah. Yeah, it, it, it's frightful. Witnesses who were inside this Wilson Avenue home told police they were playing video games last night around 9:15 when 13-year-old Laquan Rich Cabbage Stalk allegedly shot 13-year-old Chase Jones. Rich Cabbage Stalk then ran out of the home before first responders declared Jones dead at the scene. How are we going to stop it? What are we going to do going forward? Questions. Council member Wade Prescott says she plans to bring to city council in hopes of getting answers to prevent further tragedies. Do we need to implement a curfew? Do you know what I mean? What can we do? And then go from there. And again, Rich Cabbage Stalk facing a criminal homicide charge as well as a minor with the possession of a firearm. Reporting from Clarendon, Tori Orgy for Pittsburgh's Action News 4. After last night's shooting, the Clareton City School District canceled school. District leadership says they will have counseling and support services available to students, and they will operate on remote learning tomorrow.